What's up everybody and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Chess Doctor here with yet another banger and in today's weekly Chess Doctor video we are continuing the chess adventures. We're gonna play some rapid as we usually do. I hope you're gonna enjoy this content and if you do make sure to uh, leave, a, leave a like and subscribe to this channel, okay? So let's find our first victim of the day and uh, let's hopefully crush their soul as I usually would say. If you want to check out my live streams make sure to go to kick.com slash zapatzapetti there is where I stream okay guys so usually I'm active there but once a week I come back here to greet you all okay because uh, I didn't forget about you guys I didn't so I think we're gonna just since we have this type of situation immediately go with this move my brightness on my laptop is way too harsh, I can't. Uh, and I'm gonna push it again. Yeah, I'm gonna push it again, I don't care. <laughs> Guys, this is my gameplay, okay? I never think things through. I just I just do be playing the moves, I just do be moving pieces. That's why I'm stuck in 900 ELO. Uh, but luckily I didn't go back to 800 in a long time. So I think we're actually uh, pretty much chilling. We do be chilling, and we did make them think now, so I think this is pretty Gucci. Hmm. Should we take this? Because he's gonna have to kind of take with this pawn. I can go here, honestly, now that he plays the horse here. Hmm. I think I'm gonna do that, okay? Because then I'm kind of like targeting this same in the fried liver. Uh, but now he did not take this. And I think I should just take it. Okay, I'm gonna take it. I don't care. I don't care. I think I should. Because if I pushed it, I think it's way too much. He could go back here. I don't know what would happen. Okay, guys, I'm not a professional. Uh, should we just play this move? <laughs> I'm out of ideas, but we managed to open his king. So I think that's pretty bussin', right? Okay, you know what? Screw it! Let's gamble, let's gamble and gambit the pawn, guys, because why should we care, okay? Why should we care? So, I'm gonna go like this. Okay. And now my position is pretty open. And I'm kind of liking that. Should I sack this? I don't know why, but I think I should, okay? Because kind of, we're then coming in here and we're kind of threatening, okay? He, he can't go here because the bishop is closed. I don't know how can he even defend this. Okay, yeah, I, I, this is pretty ridiculous. How can he defend this? I don't think he can. Okay, so he sacked the rook and I think we're pretty winning in this position. Uh, it's time to resign opponent. It's move 12 and it will be the time to resign. It's resign o'clock. <laughs> okay, pretty as I think we we won this game because what, he can sack his queen so that I don't have a maid but then I'm playing up a queen and he did that. Okay, so sir did that. Okay, I could have also taken with a bishop. I didn't even see that part. I could have just easily taken with a bishop and invite my bishop to the play. Uh, now I'm supposed to make like I think moves like this because I really need to develop this bishop. Uh, yep. I think I should do that because yeah, I'm gonna do that. I don't care. I just want to develop him somewhere. Okay, they are bad. Okay. Okay. Thank you for the points, sir. What the hell happened here? <laughs> this was so easy. How many moves did we play? 13. Okay, quick game review. I think that uh, the rook sack was a brilliant one. It was pretty easy, okay? So this is this is why whenever I see this Pianchetto shit, I always go and just push the pawn. And we do have a brilliant! We do have a brilliant, guys. Let's freaking go. W's in the chat or in the comments. <laughs> I get confused because I come from the streams from Kick and then I, I speak like W's in the chat there and things like that and here I forget 
you're not watching me right now. You're gonna watch after I pose this. But here we go. We have the brilliant rook sacrifice um, because we the way to win a knight. Okay. Okay, so this was easy. I should have, yeah, I should have taken with the bishop because then I would have an even better position, but this was just as, okay? So let's play another one because it this would be a way too short video if we only played one. <coughs> and we have my favorite opening for black on the board, Anglum Gambit, guys. And I'm not saying this for the memes. Honestly, I think Anglum is one of the most OP openings except when they do this uh, then we don't really know what to do but we can take this now for free I guess so let's take it so he didn't take it I think we should maybe take this or should I just ignore it hum, hum, hum. maybe I should just ignore it develop here target this as well target everything sir okay target everything we're gonna tag this and now he pushed an F pawn so we can do something like this and I don't know when will he castle in his life ever uh, we do have kind of a light squared weakness in this position so I still think we're chilling we can go here now because he blocked his queen and plus this is pinned okay okay I think this is pretty busting because this pawn here is pinned by the queen but if I take and he takes and I take he can take and I can't take because okay so he has enough defense we can go here because this is still pinned and he can't castle guys don't forget about this he can't castle but he will place his queen here mm-hmm sir mm-hmm okay I see what you're doing. I mean, I don't actually. I don't understand what's happening now in the position, but we ain't gonna say that out loud, even though we just did. Okay. Oh, uh, I think we should just the best thing go back here. But he can do this, and then we're kind of forced to trade this queen. Do we wanna? But I mean, we don't wanna lose the piece, right? Maybe we should have sacked. Maybe we should have taken. I don't know. We're gonna check it out in the game review after the game but England is wild okay we have time to s God save the queen we can do this okay this seems this seems ridiculous what the hell is happening in this position guys what where can I jump I can't jump jump much I think we should do this yeah, we should castle so we can like align the rook with the queen here. Otherwise, we're kind of sucky if he like gives us a check here. So I think we castled just in time, guys. Just in time. Uh, okay, we have to move the queen. And where should we go? Where should we go with the queen? Should we go here? Or should we just go straight back here? Hmm. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go here. I don't care. I don't think he can actually do any type of a great discovery here. He can go here. But then, then we just move the queen back here. We defend, okay? I protect, I attack, I castle, I, I do everything. <laughs> okay, it's my turn. And he did this move instead. He lost all of the castling rights. We kind of blundered. Did I blunder just now? I think I honestly did. <laughs> yeah, we can't go anywhere, sir. Oh, shit. Okay. Hmm. We can't, we can't go anywhere. I blundered. Wait, what? There is no way. I think there is yes way. Yeah, we blundered. Are we gonna take this? Hmm, okay, let's, let's take this maybe. I mean, since we blundered, let's at least take something. 
Let's at least take something, am I right? Okay, but he gave this. So we're kinda, kinda chillin'. It's like as if we blundered a piece and a pawn together at the same time. Which is not as bad as just blundering the queen on its own, okay? Uh, okay. I think I'm gonna go here. Now I'm just purely confused by this position <laughs> because we're playing down a queen, but we got two pieces for a queen. I mean, that's a trade. That's a, that's not an equal trade, but still, it, it, it do be a trade. <laughs> but doesn't matter. We're gonna, we're gonna beat him. I, I feel that, okay? I can feel it. I can feel it coming, okay? Should we trade this up? Wait, I'm thinking maybe we should sack here. <laughs> but what, if he takes... I just take with a check. And then he moves that way. Should I save my rook? Hmm. I don't think I should trade here. Okay, I'm gonna move here. I'm gonna... I'm gonna stay calm, cool and collected and I'm gonna try not to trade the pieces if I don't have to because if I trade the pieces I think it's an instant loss in a way because he's just up so much material but like this I think we can maybe actually win I, I have to go here and trade this up and I'm gonna trade it with the bishop okay see Good call. Good call, sir. Good call. Good J call. I don't know. I don't know, but we did it, okay? I managed to defend somehow miraculously, okay? But he do be targeting this. This is pinned. And we gotta be, we gotta be careful with the sauce. I still think there is chance, okay? I still hope there is chance. He's kind of strangling me, but at the same time, I don't see in which way can my opponent just get in. Maybe when we move the rook, we should have gone here so that we can push this pawn. Like this, we're just looking at our C pawn, which do be kind of ridiculous. This is also pinned, so maybe we should try and exploit that. But I just don't see how right now. Because even if this wasn't pinning my F pawn, if I go here, he just on pawn, on pawn. And he moved from the pin, okay? He moved, he moved. I can go here, attack this, because this is pinned to the queen by the rook. So, let's do that. Okay, he gave the queen. Thank you, sir! See? He's still plus three, but at least there is no menacing queen on the board, so. I'm kind of fine with that, right? Hmm. <laughs> I still think I'm supposed to push this. Because I just don't see what is the other solution. Because I really need to move my horse from here. I really need to move my horse from here. Oh. Will I ever be able to move my horse from here? I mean, one step at a time. This here wasn't the best trade of my life. But still, we won one pawn with it, so... The difference is less. But not by much, but still. Okay, 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 okay. Let's go, sir. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, okay. I really don't know where to go. I really have no idea. Okay, sir, fine. I'm gonna attack this, but I don't think it's the best, but still I can... I always have the opportunity to go here. So, we're gonna do just that. Okay, he just pushed the pawn. And now I'm gonna go and invite uh, my knight. 
I still don't think he can get in, so... Neither can I, though. <laughs> Neither can I. My rook is very weak. I'm, I can jump here. And then what? Then what exactly, sir? We go here. What does this even do? I don't know, guys. This is weird. This do be weird. Okay, I'm still gonna jump for the sake of jumping. This is a weird game. Can I defend this? No, I can't even move my... Okay, I think we lost. Yep. Because we can't even, like, disconnect them. We can't. Oh, we can't do anything. I don't have any desperado checks or something. Yeah, okay, this is it. This is this is GG. Fine, sir. Fine. I really thought... Ugh, I really thought this was gonna be better, but fine. Let's go. Let's go one more. We, we you win some, you lose some, right? This video is the perfect ex example of it. Perfect example. Okay, Scandinavian as win. Easy win from the Scandinavian. Navy? Scandinavi, Navy baby, Scandinavi, Scandinavian. Okay, I don't really care. I don't really care. They always do the same thing in this opening. They just move their queen on move two, and on a live a couple of days ago, I entered the bullet tournament. And I accidentally played the Scandinavian for the first time in my life ever. And I won with the Scandinavian, okay? Even though I don't know how to play the opening, I won. I don't know how, but I did. I did. Okay, Sir is threatening absolutely nothing. So we're gonna cancel. We're gonna cancel. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I don't know, wait, if I go here and he takes and I think he can take because my bishop do be defending this. I kind of want to like move my queen here. I don't really like it when queens look at each other because that's like, oh, we're, there is a high chance I'm either gonna blunder my queen because I'm blind or we're gonna trade the queens and I don't like either of the options see he castled here so that's that hmm. <laughs> should I go here that wins him a pawn maybe we should first place the rook here and he places his rook there as well should I go here oh come on Honestly, let's go there. I don't know why, but I feel like Stockfish would play this move Queen C1. I just play intuitively, guys. I have no idea what's happening ever on the board. So if you ever play against me, just keep that in mind. <laughs> but sometimes my intuition do be god tier. Sometimes like 1800s can't do anything. I mean, it is what it is. It depends on, on which leg do I, do I wake up. Woke up on the wrong foot. How do you wake up on a foot? That's crazy. You wake up on a foot. What kind of a phrase is that? I woke up on the foot. Today, I woke up on my arm. Okay? I didn't wake up on my foot. I woke up on my arm. So what does that mean now? Hmm? What does that mean now? You tell me, sir. You tell me. Okay, if I go here. And he takes. We can take. Take, ah. take, 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 take. Okay, I think we can actually do that. His rook placement didn't mean much here, honestly. I forgot this pawn that was existing here. But still, 
I, I always like to have a good rook on e1 and a queen on c1 for some reason. Queen c1. I mean, at least it sounds powerful, right? Okay, so this sir. This sir. He really wants me to go back with my rook and then take my pawn, huh? That's the, that's the deal. Can I sack here? No, because my queen is on the... See, if my queen was here, I would just pick this up. But like this, I have to go back and give him the pawn and blah, 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 blah. But I, I'm not sure, am I gonna like trade here? Or am I just gonna sack the bishop? I'm not sure, okay? I'm not sure what's gonna happen. I'm not sure, is he even gonna take the pawn? Can't be in my opponent's mind all the time, okay? See, queen c1 was a weird move. I really don't know why I did it. Hmm. Mm hmm. I'm thinking if I go here, I'm like low-key pinning this, but I'm like, hmm, I'm threatening a freaking trade, I'm not threatening taking the queen. Maybe the best would just be to take this. Yeah, sure, let's take it. Let's not, let's not screw around with this rook, because I really like my bishop's placement. And just attack the queen. He can't take this now because my queen is on c1, okay? <laughs> my queen is on c1. I mean, stockfish move. Tapa tapenjin, they call me. Okay, guys, that's crazy. Can I go like this, this, this? <laughs> I mean, we can see. Maybe that actually happens. But right now, the b pawn is safe because my queen is on c1. I told you guys, this is, that's a stockfish move. Where is he looking? What is he cooking? I'm gonna seriously go with my plan here. Because I just don't see... I just don't see what's happening, okay? Maybe I'm just ignoring it on purpose. But no, actually I have no idea what is the plan. What is, what is this queen looking? Where is she cooking? What is she looking? Where is she cooking? Oh, yeah. Maybe we can sack the bishop. So if he takes, we go here. And then he has to move back. And then we can... Oh, we can't go there, yeah. Yeah, then I'm gonna go here. He wanted to, like, fork me. I don't really care about that pot. Even if he attacks me, I still go here because I'm threatening checkmate. He has to address it, right? You know what's the silliest thing? He can go king f8 and just like ignore the whole last threat. That would be funny. That would be very funny. But we're in 900 elo. So I'm not really sure are they gonna think of it. But if I thought of it and I'm also 900, there is a, there is a chance they also have the same way of thinking but this okay he do be defending he do be defending okay we're gonna ask start asking queen some questions because queen you have to be interrogated now she has to get interrogated now i don't care it is what it is queen move go somewhere else have a nice day yeah, I'm gonna open. I'm gonna just push. Push, push, push. And we kind of have a little bit more time. So maybe that's gonna be our advantage. And guys, I'm sorry if this footage is dark. But I'm under like the fairy lights. Because the main light. It's way too hot to be under that light, okay? It's like over 30 something degrees. I think it's 37 right now. Celsius, right? I don't know how American that is, but in American language, how much it is. Oof. I'm not sure. Should we put this here? I think I can go here. 
and then make this rook disappear go somewhere else go home or should I really just sack it or should I go here but yeah he has a move in between all of this I'm gonna go with this one because that was my initial thought and I really like the idea of having my pawns like this I don't know this position is weird they're plus uh, one pawn but that doesn't mean anything honestly and we're kind of in the same rating so that's why this game is so chaotic guys it's very weird okay we all in this rating we all do be tripping a lot tripping tripping with the queen on c1 i mean grandmaster moves right there okay i'm gonna ask the rook a question now because the rook is what is standing in my way the rook is what is standing in my way and he wants to trade it of course they always want to trade it they always always want to trade it if I sack here he takes I can either give a check here or like here should I sack this guys okay let's say he takes here and I go here with the rook he can move anywhere here if he moves here there is another check in common but still he has enough pieces okay I'm gonna go here honestly because uh, this is now pinned okay he gonna take with this uh, we have to go here because he gonna place the bishop here my queen on c1 still didn't do much okay but i believe in her i believe in my queen on c1 i don't care guys okay i trust in my queen on c1 should we go here so we can threaten this pawn yeah i think that's pretty okay because this rook is now not here so i don't know really what is he threatening Okay, I'm gonna threaten this rook. Let's see, are they gonna see it? I can see myself on camera and the whole reflection of the board is on my glasses. And he defend the pawn. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. I really don't know where to go. This is making me angry right now, okay? Okay, I'm gonna go here, but I think he can just ask me a question. But then I can just take, but then he can just take. Okay, I shouldn't actually take here with the bishop. I shouldn't take that with the bishop. Oh, I shouldn't take it. Okay. Pretty weird game, pretty annoying. Okay, I'm gonna place my rook here as well because I think that he has a lot of pressure on this place here, so. We gotta add some as well, okay? We have to stand there menacingly looking and just prepare for the cooking of nothing, but at least we're just, we're like, you know, we're threatening that we're gonna cook. But we ain't actually cooking anything. That's my secret, okay? Just pretend you're gonna cook. They're gonna think you're actually gonna, and then... You don't. And then they're like, wait, what? <laughs> wait, what? Okay, so far so good. Kind of a boring game if you ask me. Okay. 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 That's a pawn right here. And he attacked me. <clears throat> Which I mean, fine. I will go here. So we we got the pawn back and I'm threatening to give a check here. <clears throat> Which would actually be mate. So he has to defend from that. But still we can win a rook by giving this check. Which is a good thing. 
Yeah, a rook for a bishop. Nice. He went back. Okay, sir. He didn't... This doesn't work, sir. You already been there. Oh my god. They gave everything. Okay. Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. They gave every single thing. This bishop didn't do anything here, sir, for the whole game. Why put it back? Okay, quick game review. Game analysis. Let's see. What did I cook today? How many percentage? By the way, in the last game that we reviewed, what was the accuracy? 79.4. Estimate was 1450. Okay. And now we have 71.8. 1100 okay let's see the quick review i always been scandinavian it's just in my blood i think i inherited the scandinavian women genes or something from my ancestors and this was a pretty pretty normal game i was winning by 1.6 but then at one point i gave the pawn here right yeah but i was still winning here and I should have gone there. Okay, sir, didn't know. Here it was actually equal. The whole time it was equalish. It's a little bit him winning, me winning, but not by much. This wasn't the best plan. Stock Wait, queen c1. What does Stockfish think of c1? Queen c1. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I forgot. It's a good move. It's a good move, see? It's not a blunder. It's fine. Queen c1 was actually fine. This wasn't okay, yeah. But then we just started bullying the queen after he didn't let me. See, expanding here was a bussin. And here we traded. I defended from this and they thought they're gonna cook something. And you know, we were just moving pieces till eventually one of us blundered and that was them. They gave the pawn and then they gave everything. Because even though you uh, here defended the back rank, I still win the rook. So I don't mind giving the check. And here the queen has fallen. He, sh he could have just gone here and be fine. But like this, they just gave everything, okay? So guys, th these are my games. A uh, half an hour freaking video. I didn't expect it to last this long, but that's what happens when you're playing rapid. So quick archer right now, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed this weekly chess doctor video. And I hope you enjoyed watching my W's and some of my L's as well. Uh, make sure to go to kick.com slash kappacapati to check out my streams. Make sure to leave a follow. Say hi if you want to also drop some comments. Subscribe if you aren't and if you want to donate buy me a coffee.com slash kappa kapati once again <laughs> So guys, this is it. Have a most wonderful day. I hope you enjoyed this a little bit longer video and that's pretty much it I'm gonna see you next week or on kick.com Bye. Bye. See you later alligators. Bye. Bye